So one of the newer things with version 3.2 for TI Inspire is the ability to have uh, simulations built into the TI Inspire documents. So this is done via a scripting language called Lua, which is a very uh, commonly used scripting language in the programming world. And while we don't expect lots of folks to go out and program, the efforts that some of our teachers are, are creating in different organizations we work with are really rich activities to be able to explore math and science concepts. So in this example, we're kind of the students giving the setup of what the activity is around, and then in the next page in the document, we're able to now explore a concept. So here we have our energy skate part where the the student can skate away and as the student can change variables, change the, the friction of the ramp to see what happens to the, the skateboarder as they're going back and forth. Um, but all of this is done via a simulation in the background. Um, and we're creating lots of activities in our math inspired resource and science inspired resource that will allow teachers to quickly grab activities and be able to kind of have fun with the math and science concept by running these simulations and have the students explore the concepts behind it all. And again, these documents are going to work. We're looking at it on the computer, but mm -hmm. the handheld's going to be right. able and to do everything that we're looking at right now. Yeah, so it's, it's amazing to see students with just the handheld um, being able to play with this much control over a simulation and, and see what happens. So what, you know, what happens in, in various atmospheres um, with different, you know, ramp shapes and they can really, really explore what, what, uh, what the concept is. So you're not just changing the picture there, you're actually changing the, the gravity that goes along with mm -hmm. the simulation. Mm -hmm. Because everyone wants to know what it's like to skateboard on the moon versus uh, here on uh, here on Earth. And the graph that's adjusting in the background is the the various energies. Mm -hmm. Okay.